on a scale of one to never going to happen, so long as I'm a judge and you're standing there, what do you think your chances are of succeeding in your counterclaim? I thought it was pretty good, to be honest. Did you? Yeah. <laughs> Rick, there is something that concerns me or in your reply. And, Rick, I have to ask you, because I asked the same thing of Dee, and it concerns me. How often are you gambling? Uh, probably a couple of times a week, maybe. It's the maybe bit. Before this happened, Dee, your best friend over there, what would you say about Rick's gambling? I'll call it a habit. He might call it an interest. What would you say about it? I'd say he was going way over the top. He's gambling a lot, even at work. Most people come back off the lunch break with a sandwich, he'd come back with a scratch card. Just things like that, really. Are you gambling every day? No, not, not every day, no. Most? Not most, no, not, not most days. I just, a couple of times a week, mainly when I get paid at the weekend, I'll have, a, I'll have a little flutter. Well, the difficulty is that you're still in debt. Yeah. Considerably. Yes? It's just hopefully one day I'll win to get myself out of debt. That's what's in the back of my mind. That's the language of the gambler. So when you say to me, hopefully you'll get out of financial hole by gambling, do you think that that's realistic? Not really. It's just making things worse, to be honest. But you still, you, just, you never know, do you, with gambling? It's all about taking a risk. Do you feel if I told you I'm going to make a court order, Rick, that you're not able to gamble anymore, which I can't do, no court could, do you think that you could live by that ruling? Probably not. So if I ask you the question again, and it's a very important start, and it'll go a long way. Do you have a gambling problem? I suppose, to some extent, Thank I you. suppose, yeah. Thank you. Do you think that that can change? Yeah, I think I can change, yeah. Do you know about Gamblers Anonymous? Yeah. Do you think that whatever happens in respect of my ruling today, whatever debt there may be, that might be something you'd consider? Definitely, now, now my son's here, definitely, I want to just get to be the dad that I want to be without this hanging over my head and the gambling always batting away at me. For more Judge Rinder cases, click here. And if you've got a legal issue yourself, get in touch with us by clicking over here.